days later, I'm finally in Vienna. Um, I just got off the train. It's just after midnight here. It's been a long day. But thankfully, I upgraded myself to business class. So I got a lot of work done, cutting leg room, a snack. So now I'm heading to the hotel and uh, put 24 hours in Vienna, starting uh, basically now. beautiful day here in Vienna. Um, shockingly, I haven't had coffee yet. I think I've slept like five hours, uh, but I'm way more awake than I thought I was going to be. I think it helps that it's a little cooler today. It's like 70 degrees. So I think in Celsius, it's like what, 26? I, I don't know. I'm still trying to learn it, but uh, I was up early and it's a beautiful, like kind of cloudy day here in Vienna, but I'm super excited to get exploring, so let's see what we find. So for those of you that don't know me, I tend to be one of those travelers that likes to not have a plan or to be very last minute with my planning. Um, I really love just kind of aimlessly wandering around in the city because it actually makes me feel like I'm organically discovering something versus just checking off a checklist of things on Instagram. Um, which, I mean, there's nothing wrong. That's like your travel style, but for me, it stresses me out. I don't love having a schedule. I kind of just like, you know, seeing what happens next. So that's why if you're watching these videos, it seems like I never have a direction. I'm literally just winging it most of the time and, uh, it tends to work out pretty well. So, uh, yeah, let's see what happens next. Okay, I don't know if it's just the part of the city I decided to walk in, but it seems like everything in Vienna is under construction. I feel like every time I'm making a turn on the street, I'm hitting construction, and there's questionable walking paths, so I'm not sure what's going on. Uh, church is under construction. There's construction behind me. It's a city under construction, apparently.
Okay, next up, we're heading to the famous Spanish horses. Um, basically, it's a lot of the young stallions that are being ridden for dressage. Um, it's basically like a practice run for them in front of an audience with a bit of music, so it should be fun. a little bit of a late breakfast at Cafe Central. It's one of the most famous uh, cafes for cafe culture in Vienna. Naturally, I went straight for desserts. I had a bit of apple strudel, uh, chocolate, and of course an espresso because coffee is life. And uh, I'm stuck to explore a bit more of the city. First time I've ever swallowed an olive, I don't think I'll be having one again this year. Oh my god. <laughs> 